What's up everyone? Um, welcome back. Sorry for kind of like the choppy parts. Um, yeah, uh, I'll do my best not to allow that to keep happening because I know you guys are probably following through and you know, it's like, oh, he's back at the tile screen again, you know, instead of back in the gameplay, you know. Um, unless you're doing it kind of like, like how people marathon like Netflix and stuff. Um, but we are here at the Anvil. I do remember that. I remember we're here at the Anvil. I believe we made the pizza. The bomb pizza from Tiny Tina. So it's about time to go and deliver that pizza. I wonder what our tip is going to be. Hopefully it comes from Sir Hammerlock. <laughs> Sorry, I have a cup of joe in front of me. I'm uh, trying to cut the uh, energy drinks. Lately, you boys been grinding and, you know, a side effect of drinking so many energy drinks is, uh, you know, it's the caffeine in it, right? Caffeine is actually a drug. So, it's like it becomes addictive and so... I, yeah, I'm just cutting off energy drinks for the most part because not only is caffeine addictive, but energy drinks are not good for you, your liver, any part of your organ, right? Like a doctor would not inject energy drinks into your organs to save you. They inject water, <laughs> you know, something water based. Um, so I have a mixture of water, milk, a little bit of creamer. Some sugar. I know the creamer adds the sweeten, but I like a little extra, little extra kick to Daddy's juice. So, yeah. Hopefully the game loads. <laughs> hopefully. Oh man. Okay, here we are. Yep. See, I, I knew it. We were delivering pizzas. All right. Let's uh go ahead and grab some of this stuff. We should be able to sell it, too. Here we go. Ooh! Interesting! All of these little boxes! Ooh. Sorry, as you can tell, I'm trying to learn a impersonation. Like, see, that's so cute, though. Look at that. That's for the Beastmaster. It's like a little pink... Ooh. What is that, 187? That's nice, but I'm trying to not buy anything. Alrighty. So, I think I just realized that, like, every time that you, uh... No, they don't, actually. Never mind. I thought they scaled with you. Like, let's say, like, you gain, like, 10 levels, and you're just annihilating everyone, right? So, you're level 26. By the end of this playthrough, I'm level 36. Everyone should potentially be scaled to level 26, is what I so thought. But, um... Oh, okay, there's level 26 right there. But see, there's, like, level 24. Maybe it's just certain enemy types. But anyways, let's go ahead and, uh... Do this. I need to kind of warm up a little bit, so it's a good thing all these guys are there. You know, I'm actually really glad that they changed the name of uh, the the dwarf psychos because uh, it, it used to be midget psycho, right? Um, they changed that to Tinks, which honestly, like I I feel like you know, like I I've had some some dwarf friends in my life, right? And I don't think they were really. Oh, okay, this is cool. I guess it's just... Oh, never mind. Look at that. That's really cool, though. Look at that. Take a moment to admire that. But they didn't really mind being called dwarf. As a matter of fact, they kind of wanted to be called a dwarf. Because, like... M midget, it just seems kind of like... Like, I don't know. It's like... <sighs> oh, 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 oh. Okay, 22 damage every second. One sec, one sec. Okay, I... That's already... 
Oh, but it's only 18 damage. You see that? Sorry, I got so sick seeing that low of damage. Um, but anyways, yeah, they much preferred to be called dwarf than anything, if you are referring to their size. Um, but for the most part, you know, it's just like another person, in my opinion. Like, who cares? Right, who cares? Like, three, four feet tall, doesn't matter, right? Height doesn't define you. Your actions, what you say, that's what defines you. But that's just my personal opinion. Oh, that's right. We left off trying to get that one. All right, here, I'm going to show you guys. I think this is one of the difficult ones to get in the game. Here. All right. <laughs> okay. So the way I do that is I just jump and I let go of the analog. I just let it go. All right, let's go. Right here. There we go. There we go. All right. Ew. Let's enjoy the view for a second. Well done, sugar. Now let's give the people something to listen to. Don't tune into those Calypso's echo cast. They don't need the views or the attention. Like, see, look at this. I love this. This is what I was talking about in Borderlands 1. This is what I was talking about in the pre-sequel. Is... Dude, this feels like its own freaking place, you know what I mean? Like, there's not just a bunch of rocks everywhere that are the same color, same texture, just copied and pasted. You know, it's it's nice. It's really nice here. Let me make sure I get some ammo, because obviously I need to grab some more. Okay. Um, here, I'm going to come over here really quick. I know I have to just go right there. Um... Borderlands, like, you know, people people put time and effort in placing lootables around the map for you to find and potentially loot, right? So, what am I doing? Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Can I get in there? Hold on a sec. Oh, it's cut. Oh, there's a wall. You see that? There's a wall. I won't be able to get in there. Okay. But, um, you know, people put time and effort into this game, right? And so that's why I'm, like, free brainwashy. Bring friend. They spelled friend right. I like that. Come in. CLV. Um, that's the thing, though. It's like, people put time and effort into this. And so that's why I'm not as harsh with my, uh, critiques, right? As I'm critiquing the game, I'm not gonna, you know, just be like, Oh, it's just a pile of doggy doo-doo, you know? Saying doo doo because my my daughter's in, in here right now, so I kind of watch what I say around here. But that's it. All right, this is the pizza. I really like it. But yeah, like you know, people put time and effort into it, so that's why I'm also like I'm kind of tame. Like I kind of censor myself. It seems like I don't, but I do. Trust me, I really do. I like how it destroyed everything but the wall. Okay. Alright. And it looks like we're about to reach a boss room. Because, you know, Borderlands is notorious for it. You drop down and there's a boss fight. Warden watches. Let's actually look at this really quick. I, I like the line work. Right? Like, so a lot of the implied lines look really nice. Right? Um... You know, this looks like something someone from the COV definitely made. My only... Okay. Like, see, the coloring could have, like, came down to the bottom of the page. But instead, it's, like, in a perfect line across. And then right here, there's a perfect line going up. Like, you see that? And then another perfect line over here. Maybe making it a little bit imperfect. Because, like, you know, this is Borderlands. It is Pandora. Not everyone here is artsy. Like, obviously, you know, Tina's good with bombs. Mordecai's good with snipers and stuff like that. So people have their little niches that they're great with. So, like, maybe an artist could have drawn this. Um, 
but like this this just looks way too good for Pandora you know what I mean like however whoever drew that kudos on you kudos you did a really good job on that it's a nice piece to look at and it definitely shows you you know like the boss you're about to do and the eyes I know it's simplistic you know it's basically just dots however the coloring that you did in there that slight coloring great really makes it ominous all right let's do this yeah. excellent of all hunter I am Sir Hamelock. Oh, look at his eye! Oh, yeah. Sadistic Oafish Eats Rocks. Oh, look at, look at this guy. Look at him. Wow. That's such a cool... So he's... Yeah, let's extend right here. Let the bombs blow up right there. Warden. Ooh. He has some cool psycho guard warden enforcer. Look at this. See, this is what I'm talking about. That's so dope. However, I don't know why I'm seeing them now and not earlier on in the. You know, like maybe the warden. I don't know. But look, there's Mordecai. That's really cool. Mordecai's in here to support me. He's dealing some damage to uh, the warden. But yeah, I don't know why I didn't see these guys earlier on in the map. But for the most part, you know, still pretty cool. All right, let's take him out. Let's see how much. Oh, whoops! Let's see how much damage I can do. Just that right there. Ooh, what's this? Oh, okay. All right, so I think I can just run like right here. Yeah, avoid those. Get him, Mordecai. Ooh, I like how there's all these people watching, though. That's cool. But you would think that, like, you know, they wouldn't want to give away Hammerlock so they'd all be jumping down. But for the most part, they look really cool. I like it. Oh, look at that. I love the neon. I really love the neon. What are those, finger guns? Oh, no, they're not. Wow, look at that. He has a little... Oh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, because he's like a Goliath. Okay. Here, let's uh, get a little bit more hits on him. Maybe here, if they wanted to implement like psycho guards and then the the warden guards and well the warden guards, psycho guards and stuff like that, maybe they could have used them throughout this map, mixed in with like the bruisers, the psychos, the tinks, all that stuff, right? But then here, maybe they could have had like better ones to support, right? Like higher ranking, higher ranking guards to support the warden, because Hammerlock is. Well, you know, he's a pretty big, uh, pretty big trophy that the Calypsos, I would think, would not want to give up. But, you know, like, see, look at this mode right here. You can see his eyes? That's, that's so sick. Look. See, that attack's really cool. Ooh, shit. Okay, get behind. Ooh. Oh, okay. They can take his damage, too. I like that. I really like that. That's so sick. All right, uh, this one's next. Gotta try to get that experience while I'm here, you know I think boss fights are mainly like you want to try to get experience I think Because this is where the most enemies are gonna spawn or at least they should All right Jump over this. Ooh. Ooh! wow. I was taking I was taking a good amount of damage. I wonder from what? Man, something had me taking loads of damage, apparently. I need to watch my health. Okay, there we go. Raging Warden's taking more damage. I wonder if I can have Mordecai take him out. Alright. Here, I'll do a, a little bit right there. Okay. Dude, look at this guy. 
Ooh. There we go. Oh, is it my own gun that's making me, uh... Okay. Alright. Get this guy. Oh, he's leveling up. Oh, because he's killing them, so he's leveling up. Super Raging Warden. Oh, I can level him up like a Goliath. That is so cool. Oh, is he leveling up again? Mega Raging Warden. Dude, that's so sick. All right, he's probably about to deal a fuck ton of damage. I mean, sorry, flip ton of damage. All right. All right, there's more people for him to kill. I wonder if I can get him to, like, godlike. Ooh, like, see right there? He's dealing some pretty good damage to them. Alright. Did he just kill another one? Ooh, it's that attack. That attack levels him up, because those are, like, heat-seeking missiles. Ooh. Alright. Get those guys out. Because I don't want those guys to be alive, for sure. He threw a whole tire at me. Alright. Mega Raging Warden. Alright. Let's go and start dealing some damage to him. Oh! No little cloud popped up. Ooh! Ooh! Dodge that. Can I get him to level up one more time? Ooh, okay. Is he gonna level up one more time? Dang, Mordecai was just laying him in there. Alright, there we go. Let's go lower him down a little bit. Oh, yeah! I got him to kill more! I got him to kill more! Alright. What is he now? Ultimate raging. Okay, he's ultimate. Alright, so we can, we can level him up. Ooh. Alright, so it's really not that hard to avoid him, to be honest. Uh, as long as I don't hit him, I don't think Mordecai can actually have the potential to kill him. Uh, however, Mordecai can potentially take out these little guys. Like, see this one right here? It's probably about to take him out. Okay, I just need him to take out one more guy. Like, watch right here. Take him out. Do a slam or something. Ah, oh, just do a slam. <laughs> He's ultimate raging right now. I want him to be like, like godlike. I think there's one more level which is godlike. Okay. Sorry, I want to see this boss all the way through because that is actually such a cool functionality. Like, I could have just plowed him down normally, right? I could have easily just destroyed him. Here, in that case. Alright, I think this gun here would be best to lower him down a bit. Alright, jump over here, take these guys out or something. No? Oh, he's getting so big, he's getting stuck. There we go. There's a ground slam. There's another slam. Okay, we're almost there. Okay. Come on, do a ground slam, do a ground slam. Right there. Right there. No? Okay, do another one, do another one. Oh, did he kill anyone? No. Okay. Here, come on, buddy. Come on. Alright, he's about to... Come on, she's off. Oh, I got him to kill someone. No, wasn't enough. Okay, do a jump. Jump, 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 jump. There we go. Let's have him do a ground slam. Okay. All right, I'm starting to get pretty low. Here, let's go open some of these to get some health back. All right, jump over here. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy, right here, right there. There we go, oh no, never mind. Okay. Come on, 
Come on, buddy. Come on. Right here, right here, right here. Oh, fuck, right there. You're right there. You're right there. All right, here. Let's uh, come over this way. Okay, we got more people coming down. Nice. Nice. Come right here. Open this up. Ooh, two health. Two health. Nice. There we go. Right there. Right there. No. Okay, that wasn't enough. All right, we got this Warden Enforcer right here. Ready to die. Ready to die. Come on, let's go. Ground slam? Yes! Come on, keep ground slamming. Keep ground slamming. You're almost there. All right. Ooh, ouch, 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 ouch. All right, he's going to throw that. All right. Come on, buddy. Right here. Ground slam. Ground slam. Something. Come on, bro. Come on. I want you to go to go God. <sighs> Come on, bro. I'm not killing them. All right. Let's go right here. Right here, buddy. Right here. You got a bunch of weak psychos here. There we go. Do a ground slam. There we go. Yes! No? Okay. Not yet. Well, there's another damage. He's not really dealing too much anymore. Okay. Come on, buddy. Come on. You're like halfway there. <sighs> Shit. He's right there. Yes! No, he didn't kill him. Here, do a ground slam. Ground slam, ground slam. Do a ground slam right here, right here. Yes! No, come on. K kill this one. Kill this one right here. Okay. Are you gonna level up? No. Come on, please. For my viewers. For my viewers. Just level up. Come on. Ugh. Damn. Okay. You're not gonna level up, are you? Here, let me... Instead. Okay. We got 123 right there. I got this one. Ground slam. Come on. Why aren't you taking any damage, bro? Okay. I can't dodge forever. That's the thing. I cannot dodge forever. Come on, bro. Kill him. Fuck. That was me. Okay. Alright, so I got this guy. Alright. There we go. Come on, buddy. Here. Oh, that was critical. Shit. Alright. Alright, he's down. Do a slam, do a slam. <sighs> Dude. Dude, I just want him to go God. That's it. That's it, man. He should be able to. Alright, I got two right here. I got two right here, but he is jumping. There we go. Let's get out of there. Okay, get him. Get him. Ooh, jump. Okay. I just want you to take this guy out, man. Dude, you're like right there to take this guy out. Ugh. Ah, dude. I don't know if it's gonna happen, everyone. I really don't. I keep trying, but I don't know if it's gonna happen. Okay, I got him down. Shit. Alright, come on, right here. Shit. Alright. Dang. <gasps> okay, he killed someone, he killed someone. Is he gonna level up? <gasps> yes! Yes! Yes, 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 yes! We got it, we got it. Did we just get it? Did we get it? Godly Warden, let's go. That is what I'm talking about, dude. 
Okay, now I need to I need to put the hurt in him now though. That's the thing. All right, let's go. Let's go. He's going to be definitely very hard to kill. So I need to There we go. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. All right, it's time to just lay the hurt into him right now for sure cuz All right, let's go. Just throw all these. Shit, 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 shit. All right. He's definitely gonna hurt for sure, but we can do it. We can do it, come on, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Get him. Get him, 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 get him. This is a max level warded, by the way. This is amazing. This is so amazing. Get him, get him, get him. Oh my gosh, we did it. We were able to do it. I was thinking it was impossible. I thought he just stopped there, but no. He was able to keep going. Whoo! Whoo! That, that's a cup of joe right here. Mm. That's right, dude. See? As long as you put your mind to it, anything's possible. That was so great. Ah, oh, dude. Yes! Alright, let's see how much money we got first. Wow. We got like about... Oh, shoot. We got more than 3,000. <gasps> no, never mind. Would have been good. Damn. Alright, well, it would have been good. Honestly, though? Honestly? It's not that bad. It's not that bad. It's corrosive. I should be stacking corrosive. All right. That chain must have a weakness. Now, I did actually think that, you know, I was going to get maybe at least a legendary since the rate of legendaries have been dropping. But then again, like, dude, I'm, I'm cool with what, what I got because that's more more money in my bank. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Yep, let's just go around and pick up everything. Let's grab everything we can. I uh, got two there. Nice. Yeah, near the end, I definitely needed to lay the hurt in him because... Yeah, that's a trick. Alright, so we freed Hammerlock. Yay! Alright, seems like he's like stuck in there, so let's just talk to him. My thanks, Vault Hunter. I'm not too worse for wear, all things considered. I'm glad that Wainwright sent you. Now, as to my incarceration, I'm sorry to say the one who traded me to those wretched Calypso twins in exchange for the Jacobs. That foul creature is my own sister, Aurelia Hammerlock. Yep. As to why she sold me to the cult. Simply put, she despises me. She always has. There is no stronger bond than family, and when that bond is broken, no greater source of pain. I haven't seen my family in ages. Not sure they even recognize me. Hmm, indeed. I shall rest here a moment and meet you back at the lodge. If I'm safely secured, I imagine Wainwright has already set plans in motion to retake his family namesake. Who's oh! up for some celebratory punches? 27! Also, by the way, I, I, and when I was uh, started playing the pre-sequel, Aurelia is one of the vault hunters you get to actually play as in the pre-sequel. The one where it's like jumping simulator? That one. It's in space and stuff. You're on a helio station, but then you get launched off into um, the, the moon that they're orbiting, I guess. Um, but yeah, dude, how cool is that? And he has that little ocular device there which um in tales from the borderlands there was a hyperion type of version of that made with a reese man we leveled up let's go ahead and uh, check our skills out oh we get to max it out finally look at that Ooh! and then we get to get this oh shoot and then oh actually wait hold up hold up hold up because I really want this, right? I really want that, but... Amar's weapon shots deal bonus damage based on the distance from her target. Yeah, so I need to get this. Three of this.